And joining us now is our chief health editor, Dr. Partha Nandy. Dr. Nandy, uh, good afternoon to you. Good afternoon, Dave. How are you? I'm doing well. How about yourself, sir? Excellent. Thank you. Excellent. Good news there. All right. With the surge of the Omicron variant, there has been some talk of a second booster shot. Is a fourth dose of the vaccine necessary to be fully vaccinated given uh, the spike in cases that we're seeing? Well, Dave, you know, that's a great question. And some countries are asking, uh, as the Omicron variant sweeps across the world, today, you know, Israel becomes the first country to start a, testing a fourth dose of the COVID vaccine. And the Israeli health ministry wants to see if the second booster, right, will provide better protection from our current variant, Omicron, especially for the vulnerable, the elderly, the immunocompromised, and for medical workers. The study that they're doing will, will look at the efficacy, Dave, and safety of this additional booster shot to determine if it's needed in general. The trial is being done on 150 medical personnel, and they received their first booster dose in August. As since then, the tests have shown that their antibody levels have fallen to low, low levels. And so about 45% of Israel's population right now have already received the third dose of the vaccine. The final approval, all the fourth dose, if it happens, will be up to the health ministry's director general. Germany, meanwhile, is also looking at possibly rolling out a fourth dose of vaccine to its most vulnerable people again. And Omicron is expected to be the dominant strain in Germany over the next few weeks. All right, so what about here in the U.S.? Any talk about a possible fourth dose of the vaccine for uh, those of us who, uh, who are vaccinated? So they've currently 64 and a half million people in this country have received a third vaccine dose or booster shot and 205 million folks have received two doses. U.S. officials, to answer your question, say right now it's too early to consider a fourth dose for most people. President Biden's chief medical advisor, Dr. Anthony Fauci, says that they must first determine how long the protection lasts for the booster shot from the Pfizer and, and Moderna vaccines. The, and the U.S. Center for Disease Control agrees that the third dose is indeed helping. It's providing value, durable protection, rather. However, once data is available on the fourth dose, then the CDC will review and see if there may be a need for an additional booster nationally. But for now, the CDC is again and again urging vaccinated people to get boosted as soon as they're eligible for the added protection for the current you know, variant Omicron. And of course, if you haven't been vaccinated, right? I keep talking about this, the best thing you can do for yourself and your loved ones in the community is to roll up your sleeves and please get vaccinated, get the shot now. And even if you are vaccinated at this point with Omicron, I mean, masking and keeping, uh, keeping your distance, I mean, taking precautions, that's still gonna be helpful, right? As, as, as this spread continues. 100% because it doesn't give you 100, it's yeah. never giving you 100% protection, but especially with this Omicron. If you're gonna be in places where there's gonna be a lot of people, especially indoors, mask up, make sure you sanitize, this social distance, and that's how we're gonna get through this with knowledge, information, common sense. That's how we're gonna get through this. Dr. Nandy, thank you. Uh, happy holidays, uh, happy new year, and hopefully uh, it will be a good one, a better one for us. Happy holidays to you, sir. Thank you. Thank you.